to tell the truth, that's why they lying on my name, on my soul I can't lose control, when y'all do the most, what's my hope? I can't lose my soul, I can't lose no more Alright yo, what is going on guys, and today we're back with another banger video And in today's video, as you can tell by the title, we do have a Rating My Subscribers Sneaker Collections video So, if you want to know how to enter these videos, because I always get asked Like, yo Paul, when did you post this? When did I miss out? When did I do this? Bro, follow me on Instagram at paul.souls Go follow me on Instagram right now at paul.souls and that's how you guys get into the rating subscribers, rating subscribers, sneaker collections, outfits, room tours, all that stuff. And whichever one you guys want me to do next, comment down below if you want me to do another room one, if you want me to do another sneaker collection, if you want me to do outfits, comment it down below. I'm going to do a rating subscribers back to school outfits, but if you want me to do something else before then, let me know. But if not, that'll be the next one. So go follow the Instagram at paul.souls right now. Go. But anyway, if you're new to the channel, make sure you take a second out of your day. Hit that subscribe button because we post every other day, which is probably better than your favorite YouTuber. Unless, of course, I'm your favorite YouTuber. Now that all the talking is out of the way, let's go through these collections. I only left the post up for literally like two hours. I don't even think I left it longer than two hours. So, hey, if you saw it, you saw it. The people that sent it were able to get in early and I only kept it up for a specific amount of time. So that way the people that actually saw it could enter and get in and it won't get overflowed with a bunch of other people. So, I'm gonna put up the pictures on the screen right now. We're gonna rate the collections one through 10 in terms of not because of like what they have, but in terms of, well, obviously what they have, but not like in terms of quantity. It's more like, cause it's somebody could have a lot of shoes. I have a lot of shoes, but not all my shoes are quality. Like a lot of my shoes are just like random like beaters that I have and random little things, but like, we're gonna rate it in terms of overall, just like, you know, it doesn't matter if there's three shoes, if it's three really good shoes, it can be a 10. If there's 30 really good shoes, it can be a 10. It doesn't matter. All right, this one right here, we got, like this one I'm talking about, we got a pretty good variety. Variety, I still can't say that word from the sneaker collection, but anyway, we do got um, some Gucci's, we got some Adidas, like we got Nike's, we got Union 2's, Fire, which I still want the blue pair. Even though I have the cream Union 2's, I do want to get that blue pair because I feel like the, I just want to complete the set. I don't know, that's just me. I see Green Bean 5's. Ooh, I love I love green bean fives. I kind of still want those too, the new the newly released one because I had my 2006 pair. Um, but they got some sixes, the fours, the twelve. I like the Jordan collection a lot. Like those are some pretty good retros to have. Um, so I like this one, and I'm gonna give this one an 8.5. I like this collection. It's calm. Next, again, I didn't care what you guys, what your collections looked like. It was just I picked whoever sent it, and that's what you guys are getting. So we did get the Nike Dunks. We got some foam runners. We got some Yeezys in the bins. I see some Jordan threes. Got some off white fours. Okay, heard you. Got two pairs of Yeezy slides and, and another pair of fours. The Royalty fours, which is actually a sneaker back in the day when the Royalty fours came out i went to the mall and bought those i waited online and i bought those i camped out for royalty fours yeah i'm pretty sure they sat too like it was like the easiest like i didn't even camp out it was like an hour or two but like still i went early to the mall for those but anyway the, this collection right here i like a lot it's very good pieces single pieces it's pretty good you know you got yeezys and jordans and dunks you know it's nothing too crazy like range but the basics i'm gonna give this one an 8.5 as well next all right we got some jordan threes 13s fives sixes air maxes crocs um timberlands we got a bunch of shoes in this one um honestly my favorite sneaker from your collection gotta be the fire and fives i really do want a pair of fire and fives but it's like i have the stealths i have like a few other white leather fives that i don't want to like buy another pair but the fire reds are so fire like i don't know let me know if i should cop a pair of fire red fours but i like this collection i'm gonna give this one like a seven it's calm next you guys see the life hack in it? If you guys remember, I think it was, well, it was quarantine time. It was during quarantine. I was making a lot of TikToks, which I'm back on my TikTok right now. If you want to go follow the TikTok and pull it out, so I'm posting a lot, like two to three videos a day. I'm going crazy on there. But I made a video. Um, I was bored in my room and I literally made a video about like ways to display your shoes. And one of the ways is you see how he has the box lids, how the box lid comes off and you can stack it and you can make shelves out of your boxes. So if anybody didn't know that, you can do that for everybody that can't afford shelves or you live in your mom's house still and you don't have a lot of room and you want to display your sneakers in the best way possible, most affordable and kind of a place that won't take up a lot of space. Definitely, you know, you just stack your boxes like that. So you got some got some free shelves right there, which is fire. You got the cool gray fours, lightning fours, which I need a pair of cool gray fours as well. Um, got some Converse, some Dunks, some Jordan 1s. I like this collection a lot and I like the fact that you did that with your boxes. I see the Union 4s too, don't think I didn't see those. I'm gonna give this a, I'm gonna give this a nine. I like this collection. Next, now actually speaking of shelves, I kind of want one of these shelves, not right now, but like when I get my own crib one day, like maybe an actual house, but I want like this type of shelf, but like complete, like a whole room of those shelves. I don't want to have like all my manga on it, all the Funko Pops, all the Legos, like all the stuff that's not sneak. Well, honestly, probably sneakers too. 
it'll probably be all in one room, but I want like the walls to be just filled with shelves so there's like no wall space. Or like at least three of the walls and then one wall will be empty and have like pictures and other things. But this one right here, I like the shelf a lot and I like, again, green bean fobs. You guys are going crazy with the green beans. I appreciate that because if y'all know, that's like kind of like a sneaker that I've loved this whole time on this channel. I always talk about them and I was happy that they were bringing them out again. So you got the infrared sixes as well. You got some fours, got some two lows. I like how you have it in number order. You got ones, twos, threes, fours, five, six, seven, eight, no, not 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Okay, I mess with this. That's tough. You guys know I'm just liking two. I got one through 16. Still missing a pair of 10s though. Still missing a pair of 10s. But I like this collection a lot. I'm going to give this a nine. Next. All right, my boy got. My boy got a few pairs of Jordan 1s. Um, I peeped the Lowe's too. That's actually a pretty nice pair of Lowe's. That Lowe's one of the best Jordan 1 Lowe's in my opinion. Got some Lightning 4s. Got some Off-White. Ooh, I see the Turtle Doves. Turtle Doves just came out again. You guys going for those? You guys mess with those? And not really, but... I don't know. I like the turtle doves. I feel like if I had to wear a 350 in 2022, it would be the turtle doves. Um, but now you can see a lot of people with them. So we'll see if my opinion changes, but not that it matters that people wear them. It's just like, you know, when something gets ran through a lot, it's just like, you don't really want it anymore. But turtle doves, if that's the OG pair, like from 2016 fire, I, you had it before the restock. Cool. Uh, got some off white prestos, off white zoom flies. I like this collection. I'm gonna give this an 8.5. Next, I like the way you set this up. You got some, I like those Converse a lot too. Those brown Converse are tough. I really want a pair of Converse. I just don't know which ones I want to get yet. I kind of want the Rick Owens and Converse collab. I don't know. Let me know if I'm bugging about that, but I kind of, I kind of like those. I don't know. That's just me. But yeah, I like these Converse a lot too. Just that brown color. But the, I had these in the low version. I really wanted the high, but I was gifted the low. So I appreciate, you know, Culture King for sending the low over. But I do want to get the high one day because I like that brown color with the cream midsole. Um, got some Yeezy slides. Got the Weatherman Kyrie's. Got the Mellow Balls. Okay, this is the first time I think I've seen a pair of Mellows. Maybe I saw it in the last sneaker collection, but I see I feel like a lot of people are copping the Mellows. Like, is that, is that a popular shoe? Like, I've seen a lot of people with them recently too. I guess you guys really do like the mellow balls, which is cool. I like that. I like that you guys like different things besides Nike and Adidas. So yeah, I got the Adidas. I think, are those the Home Alone ones or just the regular forums? I don't know. Got some Dunks, Air Maxes, nice collection. I'm gonna give this a nine. I like the all different pieces because you got Nike, New Balance, Converse, Yeezy, Puma. This is a nice collection, nice variety. Next, we got, ooh, a lot of Jordans. Um, pretty much all Jordans besides the one pair of New Balances and Yeezys, which is tough. I like those New Balances a lot. Can't go wrong with those. It's like the new Air Force One. Um, got some Jordan 4 Cool Grays, tough. Got a pair, what are those? There's another pair of New Balances. Oh, I think he's got a pair of all white um, 550s. Black Cement 3s, I need a pair of Black Cement 3s. Black Cement 3s, oh my God. I was wearing my white cements yesterday, but I, was, I just kept looking at them. I was like, why can't they be the Black Cements? I like the black cements more than the white cements. So W W W collection. I like this a lot. The, every single Jordan you have is a very very good pair of Jordans. So I like this collection. I'm gonna give this a nine. Next, the metallic fives. Yo, Jordan brand needs to bring those back out. I know the last time they brought it out, I think it was 2014. I don't remember the last time. Honestly, I think I just know it had the Nike Air on it, and I'm. Um, I don't think they're too old now. Maybe I'll actually just go back and get a pair. I just don't want them to crack, but I don't think they're that old to the point where they'll start cracking yet. So I think we should be good. So. I'm just blabbering. I just want a pair of Jordan 5 Metallics and this person just reminded me of it. So yeah, got some Red 11s, can't go wrong. Got two pairs, two new pairs. Actually, you got the Military Black 4s and the Midnight Navy 6s, tough. I like this collection. You got the Noctis too. I'm gonna give this an eight and a half, I like it. Next, my son got them all lined up. Got the Off-White 5s, which are tough. We got the pairs of ones, got the, ooh, got Breads, Shadows. Got the Travis's, got the Amaminaire 3s, that's fire. Got Sean Witherspoons. Got some Nike Dunks, got a bunch of Dunks actually, got some two pairs of other pairs of Off-Whites. I like this collection. In terms of hype, this collection is going crazy. So, um, not because of the hype though, this is going to get a 9. I just like it a lot, like it just looks, it's a lot of good pieces as well, besides like all the collabs and stuff. Next, we got some Jordan 11, Jordan 4s. I like the 11 low snake skins, I peeped those. Got the core purples. Uh, those pair, is that a pair of New Balances? Those are tough. Like the gray with like the hint of orange on the sole, I believe. It's, I believe it's an orange sole. That's kind of cool. It reminds me of like um, Jeff Staples and stuff. But yeah, this is a nice collection. I see the Berkeys. I see the two pairs of Berkeys actually. Got the Calm Timberlands in the front too. I like this. I'm going to give this a 8.5. We do have a sneaker collection from my boy Christian. He wanted to be in the video and before I edited it He did send the photo so I figured I would just react to it before I'm about to edit So he sent a lot of photos and I only let it slide because he's my friend and I let it slide I know I said only one photo, but I'm letting it slide because he's showing off his collection. So 
Let's get into it and put up the photos right now. Right here, as you guys can see, we got a bunch of dunks. He's got the Supreme dunks. He's got those like zebra type dunks. I forgot what those are called, but those are fire. Um, he's got the off white dunk, two pairs of off white dunks. He's got the rubber dunks too. Got some Supreme forces, some regular white forces. Got the Supreme tailwinds. I need those, bro. Those are fire. The Supreme tailwinds are so hard. And then, are those? They made Uno shoes? I never saw that. I never seen that before. Whose basketball shoe is that? Is that Paul George? Who is that? I don't know. I'm so out of the basketball shoe loop recently. Like, I have not paid attention to nothing. So, hey, apparently there's an Uno collab. It says it on the tongue. Then, going into the Jordans, my boy got the Jordan 4. What does? The Jordan 4, just the regular, like, metallic silver ones. Got, is that a custom on those? Oh, I messed with those. The red ones. See how the black is suede? Like, I think that was an all red. I think those were the all red suede fives. But it's got, not the Raging Bulls, I don't think, but it was just the, you know, like the all red suede ones. And he think he dyed it black, which is really fire. And then he's got the Bluebird. You feel me? The Bluebird 5s, which I got as well. Definitely a tough 5. Got the Last Shot 14s. Got some 12s. Got two pairs of, well, a pair of Dunk. And then the Sakai Blazer Lows. Tough. And then at the top, my boy got the, oh, ooh, i never seen those off-whites. And he's got the Jordan 1, the Spider-Mans, which... Still one of my biggest regrets to this day. I don't know why I sold those. Got the Gore-Texes, which are perfect for the freaking winter time. I uh, got some white and green. Oh, those are the Lucky. I forgot what those are called. Like the Lucky Jordan ones. Got the Flying in Shadows. Got some Mocha ones. Got the Threes. The Fragment Threes. Got, got the Tinker Threes, which are fire. Then off-white like van type shoes at the bottom. Got some Air Maxes. More Air Maxes. The, the Miles Morales Superstars, which I went for when they dropped. Couldn't get them didn't get them got the home alone forums beautiful got some nike supreme dunk boots i love those when he was wearing those i remember he was wearing those one time and those are so fire in person i really need that then on the bottom got some converse got some yeezys got the yeezy 500 highs yeezy 700s some air force ones and he did like like that cartoon type custom i did that to one of my air forces back in the day i didn't even know he had these got some older air forces these ones are tough the black with oh the black did he custom that as well i think he custom that as well is that an among us custom Nah, Christian, you never showed me these customs that you had. Then he's got the Adidas, the new Adidas slides that got all the hype to them. Those are fire in person, by the way, those slides. And then the foam runners, fire. And then he's got some random fours, tens, and elevens. So shout out to Christian for sending that over. That's a 10 collection. You already know that though. But back to the regular collections. Next, again, four pairs of shoes. It doesn't matter the does not matter the quantity of your collection. I don't want people to think like Damn, I don't want to send Paul my collection. I only got two pairs of shoes, three pairs. Like, bro, I don't care. Send it in. I'm going to show it for you. Don't worry, bro. We don't discriminate over here. This is a nice collection. Got the Jordan 4, the green metallics. Bro, one of the best fours, in my opinion. One of the best fours. Got some blazers. Can't go wrong with that. Got a pair of New Balance 2002Rs. The best New Balance model, in my opinion. This is a nice collection. I like this. I'm going to give this an 8.5. Next. Now, I was really hoping that when you guys were gonna send me these that you would send it with your setup but then i was like not everybody has their sneakers like in a setup area if that makes sense like i figured out people put them in boxes and stuff but i was kind of hoping to see people set up so i like that he sent it in a setup i see a bunch of supreme decks bare bricks i see a bunch of video games in the back i like the way that the two corner like it goes into the corner of the shelves they look very very good this whole setup is very very nice and the sneaker collection is nice as well i peep all the ones the fours i see I, you know what i realized a lot of you guys, just ones and fours. It's a lot of ones and fours. Every collection. I don't think we've had one collection in this video that there wasn't at least a one or a four, if not both. I don't know what that says, but you know what that says. But yeah, um, I really love those green New Balances at the top. Me and Amanda really want those. It's the 2002R. I forgot. I think it's Brian Gills is the collab. You guys, I don't know if you guys can see it that well on the, the photo, but it's the green pair at the top to the right. These, those are beautiful. That is one of the best New Balances I've seen probably ever if not one of my favorite new balances it has like this like nice like stitching embroidery on it the new balance it comes off it's velcro the mule of it too there's a mule 2002r very very tough probably a sneaker we'll pick up in the future for sure like i know i said in this video a lot of shoes that i want from this but like a definite cop is these 2002rs with the the green and the stitching on it so very fire collection i'm gonna give this a nine and a half next okay my son got the georgetown ones respect, respect. i feel like we haven't seen those a lot i feel like we have not seen I feel like I don't see anybody with the Georgetown ones, to be honest. Like, I don't see nobody wearing them in the store. Like, because I work in District 1, obviously, I work in a sneaker store. I don't feel like I see a lot of, we don't have them in store either. Like, is everybody just holding their pairs? Like, what are y'all doing with your Georgetown ones? But he has the Jordan ones, Jordan, a lot of Jordan ones. Got some one lows, got some dunks, got some fives, threes, fours, sixes. 
Air Forces. I like this collection a lot. Ooh, I peeped the up tempos in the back. I like this collection. I'm gonna give this a nine. I actually really mess with this collection. This is a this is a nice pair. This is a nice collection. Next, okay, so we got some Jordan ones. Yet again, some Jordan fours. I we have not gone one collection without a Jordan one or Jordan four in it. Then we got the threes. I peeped the threes. That's the flip threes. Very slept on three. I don't feel like a lot of people know about those flip threes. Um, I see some designer shoes at the bottom, right? Sheesh, heard you. Got some royal ones. Nice collection. I'm gonna give it an 8.5. Next, I feel like we've we've seen this before, this picture before. I remember the boat. I remember the boat with the net and like, yeah, this is a nice display. It's literally a freaking boat, but turned into shelves. So, well, I don't know if it was a boat or if that's just the design of the shelves to look like a boat, but nonetheless, it looks like a boat with shelves on it. And you got some Jordan 11s. I like the Quantums. Quantums, very, very slept on, easy model. I feel like it's one of the best easy models. And, and it just needs a little bit more love. I like the blue pair. I had the blue pair. I had this. I had an orange pair too, and I wear them a lot. They actually did get worn. They're very comfy. They look good with all types of pants. So quantums are definitely slept on. I'm gonna give this collection a. Wait, is there a Jordan one in it or four? I don't. Oh, there's a Jordan one. This is Jordan one low. Damn. I thought we were gonna get away without a Jordan one in the collection, but I keep the Kyrie's at the top too. I'm gonna give this collection a 8.5. Next, we got three pairs of Jordan 4s at the top of the shelf. Got some Air Max, a lot of Nike runners. I like that though. I like that there's a lot of different Nike runners. I people, like there's a good majority. I like the black and white ones at the bottom. I forgot the name of those. With like that thick sole. It kind of looks like, um, kind of looks like a Tom Sack shoe. Um, then you got a bunch of Air Maxes. I love the different Air Maxes. I like the Concepts Air Maxes. I like the pad, the two pairs of pad is actually, I like the ones below it on that row to the right with the little teal swoosh i don't know the name of those but those look hard so i like this collection a lot i'm gonna give this a nine all right i have yet to see this is another thing i've yet to see too it is the black boxes i believe um it's just the regular container store ones i don't see a lot of people with the black boxes i see a lot of the clear ones like i have the clear ones in my closet but i've yet to see the black ones so i like that um i peep jordan fours i peep jordan ones I like the fives, I like the tens. Ooh, a lot of pairs of twelves. Okay, variety. I like the fourteens at the top left. I did just get those. I love the Rip Hamiltons, those are fire. Nice collection. I'm gonna give this one a nine. Next, back to the clear drop from the boxes. My boy got, I believe, a pair of purple new balances at the bottom. That's kind of cool. Got some Jordan 1 lows, Air Force Ones, got some Yeezy slides, got some Converse, some Jordan 4s, some Yeezy 350s in there. I see it. Okay, is that a pair of vans too? Oh no, that's a pair of Converse at the bottom. I like this collection. I'm going to give this one an 8. Alright y'all, so that is pretty much it for today. That was rating my subscriber sneaker collection. Shout out to everybody that sent a collection through. If you guys do want to be in a future rating anything video or just anything that involves subscribers, make sure you are following me on Instagram at paul.souls, okay? Okay? Alright y'all, so that's pretty much it for today. I hope you guys did enjoy. I appreciate all the support. I feel like it's been a minute since I was able to do a sit down video. I've just been on the go, on the go recently. You guys noticed it. it's been a vlog after vlog after vlog. So it was nice to do a little sit down video. Calm down and relax. But we'll be back to the vlogs and more sit down videos in the upcoming videos. So leave a like on this video. Comment down below. Hit that subscribe button if you're new to the channel. And I'll catch you guys in the next one. And we out. Good. But I wanna run up the money and love with the music I do it with passion. Yeah. You see me thumbing through hundreds for all this designer and love with the fashion. Yeah. Yeah. I'm moving with the money, they calling me Michael, I'm feeling like Jackson.